Hi again, everybody. Welcome to Enjoy English School. I'm Bruce, and I'm Laurie. Today we start a two-day program. It's our biography section, so we're going to take a close look at someone today and tomorrow. Who is that person? Junji Ito, Japan's master of horror manga. That's a very good one. <laughs> 好，所以呢，各位这个同学们，我们今天呢来到了人物传记的单元啊、哦。那么要来看到的文章的主题呢，今天跟明天两天都是来谈论到日本当代的恐怖漫画大师，也就是伊藤润二。所以应该很多这个同学都喜欢恐怖漫画的都知道他。那我们赶快来看一下。Okay, let's take a look. First paragraph, first sentence. Junji Ito is one of Japan's top manga artists.、Uh, this gentleman is a manga artist. Manga is Japanese for what we would call either comic book or cartoon drawing and storytelling.、Uh, cartoon, C A R T O O N. C A R T O O N. In English, a cartoon can be just one single picture with usually some words under it. One person is saying something to someone else, for example, or it can be a movie-like presentation of cartoon characters. They are drawn imaginary characters, and it's usually not a full movie. It's just a few minutes. And、uh, maybe three minutes, five minutes, something like that. That's also a cartoon. But manga in、uh, Japanese refers to a special kind of drawing. There's a whole book, usually with、uh, a leading character, and、um, they had a basketball character many, many years ago. I、uh, don't know if that's still. 灌篮高手 I think. <laughs> <laughs> something like that's an example, and.、Uh, Manga are very, very popular, and not only in Japan. 嗯，好的，所以我们来看到文章进入第一段的第一句哦，来讲到说呢，伊藤润二呢，他是世界顶尖的这个呃日本顶尖的这个漫画家之一啊、哦。这个因为我太喜欢他了，所以刚刚讲成世界了啊、哦。那么呢，这边刚刚有提到这个 manga 是一个日本语来的外来语进入了英文啊、哦，所以呢。这个 manga 就是漫画，它的这个日本的发音，那变成英文的这个外来语的字。那否则的话呢，原本的这个漫画在英文里头的话，大家比较常见到的是 comic book 这样子的用法，或者是刚刚这个 Bruce 老师帮我们介绍的这个 cartoon 的这个 drawings 啊，尤其是我们有时候在那种杂志啊，或者是报纸上会看到，就是一格图，然后下面会有一些小字啊，那可能是一个对话或什么的，然后这样子画的这种的这个叫做 cartoon 的一个 drawing， 对。Mm. Okay, let's continue.、Mm. Reading his stories often feels like having a nightmare that keeps getting worse and worse. He's a special kind of manga artist. Some of them, of these artists, they they like to draw love stories or young men who want to prove themselves in the world. But this one is sort of like、um, uh, Stephen King. In the United States, who only writes things which are supposed to frighten you in some way or scare you, that's like having a nightmare. A nightmare is a dream, usually at night, of course,、uh, that、uh, you may wake up crying or sweating because you're so afraid, and it keeps getting worse and worse. So,、uh, if he can keep you frightened for a whole story and more and more. Frightened. Ooh, Ichiban. <laughs> That's for sure. So, 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 然后呢，这里的 keeps getting worse and worse， 那个 getting 哦，就是变得怎么样怎么样，那么更糟，那就是 worse and worse。所以这里有一个动态的感觉呈现。哦，那刚刚呢，布鲁斯老师也用了一个很好的这个，除了 scare 之外的动词叫做 frighten。Can we spell that, please? 
F R I G H T. Fright is a noun. It means great fear. Frighten. Homi and ja e n. There's your verb. P P so zai ja e d. So F R I G H T E N E D. I'm frightened. And it is frightening. 这样 ，OK。所以呢，这个这种的动词的后面哦，你加了 ing， 它就变成是主动，是令你觉得怎么样啊、哦？那如果像是后面加 ed、pp 的话，就是刚刚布鲁老师演的，你你感到怎么样？所以你是一个被动的一个形态。好、哦，所以这种动词其实背起来蛮好，因为它就直接有两组的用法。这样 ，OK，Please、okay, continue。Unlike other horror writers, Ito's comics do not feature lots of blood or Famed monsters, Godzilla, Godzilla, <laughs> but that's not manhwa. That is、uh, a movie.、Uh, maybe it was originally、Probably. manga. I don't know. But、uh, here he does not. Ito does not depend on、uh, vampires or monsters from space and a lot of people dying and bleeding. He has other ways to frighten his readers. 没错啊、哦，所以呢，这个讲的蛮好的。Bruce 老师说，他用这个来吓读者的方法是不同的方法了。所以呢，也如同我们的句子讲到说 ，unlike other horror writers， 就是跟这个其他的哦，这个恐怖作家不一样的地方的是啊、哦，这个伊藤呢，他的这个漫画这个并不是以什么为主打，叫做 do not feature 什么什么什么啊、哦。那他不以什么为主打呢？他不以大量的血腥。或者是一些著名的怪物来主打。好，那么当然下一句就会告诉我们，那他的故事主打什么呢？啊、oh. ，Most of the time, his stories are scary because they are about facing the fear of the unknown. Many people like to read his stories not to see people getting killed or eaten by monsters and things like that. The, his stories are scary or frightening. As we just spelled for you, because they are about the stories tell us and make us feel about something that we don't understand, we don't know about, but we do know that something's wrong. 嗯，所以呢，接下来果然就告诉我们，那它的特色是什么呢？其实呢，常常啊，它的故事呢，会那么的吓人，是因为呢 ，they 这里是指这些故事啊，是 are about， 就是关于呢。这个面对未知的恐惧叫做这个 fear of the unknown 啊，所以面对未知的恐惧，那么这个才是它的恐怖漫画的特色所在。Okay, we hope you understand so far. Now let's take a break before we finish our article. Welcome back. Now let's continue with our second paragraph. The ideas behind Ito's works are always interesting and special. Well, if he's very popular, you can guess that he must be doing something that appeals to a lot of people, and he seems to be a master of horror. He knows how to scare people. 没错，所以接下来我们进入第二段来讲到说呢，伊藤润二他作品背后啊的这个概念叫做 the ideas behind Ito's works。那么呢，常常是既有趣啊，又呢特别的。那刚刚呢，这个 Bruce 老师用到一个很好的动词片语，叫 appeal to， 就是吸引的意思。我们来拼一下 ，a p p e a l， a p p e a l， a appeals to b。嗯，所以呢，这个动词片语的话呢，就是吸引的意思，可以把它背下来啊。Please continue。Okay， next sentence。Uzumaki is about a town where people can't stop looking at spiral shapes. Well, this is such an unusual idea. <laughs> He's a very creative artist, in、mm. in my opinion. Notice Uzumaki. This word, first of all, it's in italics, not because it's a Japanese word, but because it's the name of a book or the name of a story or the name of a poem. And so on.、Uh, if you have a foreign word in your writing, if it's commonly used, for example, sashimi. If we write that in English, almost everybody knows what that means. 
So we don't need to put it in italics. But words that are not usually known, it's helpful to a reader to know that this word is not spelled wrong. This word comes to us from a different language. So we learn that Uzumaki is a Japanese town, and it's strange because the people there always are attracted to looking at things that have a spiral shape, like some kinds of shells, seashells. 没错，所以呢，这里我们一开始继续来看到啊，这个句子的一开始，这个 Uzumaki 呢，就是日语的漩涡的意思。那这里的话呢，它呢，第一个字母大写以及整个字呢斜体。当然，就是因为它是 title 啊的标题的名称，不管是书啦、啊，或者刚刚布鲁斯老师讲的电影标题啦，或者诗的标题啊，或者是这个呃音乐歌的标题啊，只要是标题的名称的话，那它就是记得要这样子来呈现啊。所以呢，漩涡呢，它是关于一个小镇，这个镇上呢，人们呢都会忍不住叫做 can't stop doing something 啊，忍不住呢就会一直去看着这个螺旋的这个形状的东西。Over time, the spirals make them either kill themselves or go crazy.、Uh, this is not what we expect. First, we don't expect that people will be so attracted to, or that spiral shapes will attract them or appeal to them, so that they keep looking at them until they either kill themselves or go crazy. They lose their minds. 没错。所以呢，接下来讲到，那么久而久之叫 over time。随着时间过去呢，那么这些呃螺旋状的东西呢，竟然会使得他们啊、呃，这个他们当然就是小镇上的这些人们呢 ，either A or B 啊、呃，就是不是呢这个样子，就是那个样子。那不是呢，互相的残杀，就是呢这个发狂了。所以这个 go crazy 也等于刚刚布鲁斯老师讲到的 lose somebody's mind 啊、呃，这两个可以一起写下来。Gyo shows strange fish with legs that attack people because they are controlled by an evil smell. Again, this is such a creative idea. You might think, "Oh, that's crazy." Well, it is in a strange way and in a scary way. What if it were true that fish had legs? They could walk around and attack people. They could hurt people.、Uh, But it's not because the walking fish want to do it. They are controlled by an evil smell. Evil is the worst, not just bad. It's the worst. An evil smell will be something terrible, and it makes them do terrible things. 是的，所以呢，接下来这一句讲到鱼啊、哦，这个呃这一部的呃作品的话呢。则是呢，描绘出啊，就是一些长着脚的奇怪的鱼呢，会怎么样啊？他们是会攻击人们的。那么为什么呢？因为他们是被一种恶臭所控制着。所以刚刚呢，讲到这个 evil 哦、啊，所以呢，这个这里的话不是当邪恶来讲。刚布鲁斯老师提到，它是呢比这个呃 bad 还要更糟啊。所以呢，这个这样子的 smell， 这样的臭味就是恶臭。你可以这样子来翻它。Okay, now we've looked at two different stories. Uh, comic books by、uh, Ito. Now we're looking at the third one. Tommy tells the tale of Lori, whose beauty drives men crazy, <laughs> making them do terrible things. <laughs> Can we skip the last part? <laughs> <laughs> Tommy is the name of the book. Again, Xie Ti Zi in italics、mm. tells the tale, tells the story of a. Pretty woman whose beauty. So she's a beautiful woman, a pretty woman. It drives men crazy, but not in a good way.、Mm. It、uh, makes them do terrible things. They hurt other people, or maybe hurt themselves. 没错，这个布鲁斯老师非常的了解啊。所以呢，接下来的第三本作品要看到的是《富江》啊，《富江》这个也是他作品当中很有名的一部。那么讲到讲述的是一个美这个美女的故事啊，那么这个美女呢，她的美貌啊，使得男人们发狂，而让他们去做出一些很恐怖的事情。
Okay, let's finish our article for today, the last paragraph. But remember, we have a whole other day tomorrow for you on the same subject. The first sentence of our last paragraph today is, people say that Ito is a master at building tension. Well, if you want to make people feel nervous or afraid, then if you're successful, it makes them feel stressed or afraid, scared, frightened. And he's a master at this. That's why so many people like to read him. 那接下来我们进入最后一段的第一句哦，讲到说呢，这个 people 啊，那这个 people say 哪些 people 呢？当然是读过这个伊藤润二的漫画的读者们呢，他们总说哦，伊藤润二是这个营造紧张感的大师。这里的 a master 啊，我们常常遇到这个字，被讲到是 master， 那你就会很爽。为什么？因为这个就是大师的意思，高手的意思。那么呢，这里的 building tension 的这个 tension 啊，是这个呃紧张感的名词啊。那么这个一旦 build 这个 tension 之后呢，那么就会出现这个像刚刚布鲁斯老师提到的，你会进入一个 scared 啊，或者是 frightened 啊，或者是呢这个 stressed 啊，或者是 afraid 这样的一个状态。那这里面呢 ，stressed 它比较特别，它本来是压力的意思。我们先请布鲁斯老师拼一下 ，s t r e s s。That's the noun and the verb. So, ja ed, and we have the pp. If you are stressed, if you feel stressed, you're very nervous. You're very anxious. That's a、uh, a little different from afraid,、uh, scared, or frightened. But in this、uh, sense of reading these kinds of manga, horror manga, it it works.、Mm. You can feel stressed reading the manga. 没错。所以呢，这边刚刚讲到说，虽然它是指压力，所以呢，这个被动的 PP 去表达的就是感到很有压力哦，这样子的一个描述。但是在这里，它虽然不等同于害怕，可是呢，因为这个你读的又恐怖，然后让你又有压力啊、哦，因为你要面对的 fear of the unknown 啊、哦，所以呢，当然你就会觉得哦，这个很有压力感。所以刚刚布鲁老师提到，在这边哦，这个东西它是可以很适合用的。那也等于刚刚讲到的另外的 nervous， 或者是还有一个字可以学叫 anxious。Can we spell that, please? A N X I O U S. A N X I O U S. Here, the X is、uh, ng, the in anxious. Hmm. 好，所以这个字可以也把它写下来。Okay. Please continue. Thank you. Most of his works begin with a simple idea. I'm so glad we have this sentence because <laughs> works. Usually, work does not have a plural. Many of my students will say, "Oh, our teacher Bruce gives us so much homeworks to do. <laughs> no plural for that kind of work. I have a lot of work to do. I have much work to do, but not works. Except here, when we talk about art,、mm -hmm. then we can use works of art, art works, or his works." Begin with a simple idea. It's not so difficult to understand. It's easy to understand at the beginning of the story, and that may appeal to you. It may attract you to keep reading. 没错，所以呢，接下来讲到说，那么大部分他的作品啊、哦，都是由一个很简单的概念来开始的。那刚刚这边刚刚布鲁斯老师提醒大家，这里的 work。哦，本来我们当工作讲的话呢，它是一个集合的名词，它其实是不可数的。哦，所以你不会出现 s 这种复数的这个尾巴。但是在这个一般来讲，我们这个讲到艺术作品的时候呢，但它就可以加 s 了。所以你这边才会看到的 most of his works 是这样的原因。And remember that works is not just the kind of art you usually think of, like drawing and painting. It also refers to works of literature. So Shakespeare's works, or、um, English Victorian novels, the works of certain writers. 没错，那所以呢，这里的作品啊，其实跟我们中文刚好一样，就是它没有呃特别会让人只想到画画啊，所以呢，作品当然就包含了各式各样的创作品啊，所以它可能是刚刚这个布鲁老师提到的莎士比亚的文学作品。它也可能是一部电影的作品啊，或者是一首音乐的作品，都是可以的。那这种的，你想表达有好多作品的话呢，你就可以帮它加一个 s。Then 
readers learn a little bit more about the story with each turn of the page. I like this expression in English, to turn the page. As you keep reading, as you turn the pages, you, you are taught or you find out just a little bit more about the story. He doesn't tell you everything at first. That's not good storytelling. 好，所以呢，接下来这句他讲到说啊，既然是用这个简单的概念开头，那开头之后呢，所以讲到 then， 然后呢，这个读者们就会开始呢，这里的 learn 不是学习了啊，这里的 learn 是这个呃，慢慢的发现或去知道啊，一点一点的去发现，一点一点的去看到了什么东西呢？就是这个故事啊，那是怎么样的一个进度法呢？是随着你每翻一页，你就又多知道了一点这个故事的发展。是这样的感觉。那这边的话也提醒大家啊，我们刚刚这个呃 ，Bruce 老师提到说 ，turn the page 的话，那个 turn 是一个 verb 动词，但是这里的 each turn of the page， 这里的 turn 是一个名词啊， right. 一个 noun， 所以这个是小心的地方。And we finish with this for today. By the end, Ito reveals to them, them are the readers, you and me who read his manga, the full picture. Ah,、uh, now we don't have just a simple beginning, a simple idea. Now we can understand the whole story, and the terrible evils that his characters are facing. We can appreciate, we can understand how bad these forces, these evil forces, are. 没错，所以最后这一句讲到说，那么到结尾的时候，哦、oh, ，by the end， 在故事要结束的那个时候呢，那么伊藤呢，这个伊藤呢，他就会 reveals to somebody 的意思是把什么揭露给这个对象啊、哦，让他们看到的意思。所以这里的 them， 刚刚布鲁斯老师提到，就是读者向读者们揭露这个故事的全貌，叫的 full picture。然后呢，以及他的角色们所正在面临的那些恐怖的邪恶。Okay, as I said, that's it for today. But part two tomorrow. Join us then. Until then, bye bye. 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 第三十八页人物传记，日本当代恐怖漫画大师伊藤润二。Junji Ito, Japan's master of horror manga. Junji Ito is one of Japan's top manga artists. Reading his stories often feels like having a nightmare that keeps getting worse and worse. Unlike other horror writers, Ito's comics do not feature lots of blood or famed monsters. Most of the time, his stories are scary because they are about facing the fear of the unknown. The ideas behind Ito's works are always interesting and special. Uzumaki is about a town where people can't stop looking at spiral shapes. Over time, the spirals make them either kill themselves or go crazy. Gyo shows strange fish with legs that attack people because they are controlled by an evil smell. Tomie tells the tale of a pretty woman whose beauty drives men crazy, making them do terrible things. People say that Ito is a master at building tension. Most of his works begin with a simple idea. Then readers learn a little bit more about the story with each turn of the page. By the end, Ito reveals to them the full picture. And the terrible evils that his characters are facing.